some top level uh, approach uh, from our side of how you can how you can work with this. So uh, with this framework. So when you come to define your priorities, you know one area that you could look to is uh, to this as being materiality. So depending on your industry and your sector, you can see the ESG topics that are most relevant uh, to be covered off. Uh, and that will already help you filter from the 170 down to a, a more narrow category that's relevant to your industry. Uh, and then from that, you know, really looking at the actual metrics that you might want to include. include. So for each materiality, selecting the relevant metrics from that list based on, you know, the each, where you want to place your effort um, and focus in the beginning. And from a purely pragmatic point of view, it may be driven by, uh, not only your industry, where you are, uh, you know, the, the topic that's most relevant for business, but also where do you have data that's currently available? Where can you actually have numbers to put behind the metrics? Uh, and this may be, you know, a, a phased process. There may be those uh, low hanging fruit where you currently have the data and you can easily report on a certain metric. Uh, and then, you, but you may also need to identify some areas where you may not have the numbers um, and to, you need to establish some processes and some will be easier to establish than others. So this is also sort of this prioritization that you can um, uh, use in selecting the metrics to include uh, really from a pragmatic side, you know, how, how easily um, uh, can you report on certain metrics? Uh, and then the third question, uh, you know, here it's just one simple line item, but certainly not a very easy thing to do uh, is really setting those target levels. So, so, so you, to your point, um, that is a very uh, important part of the process. Uh, we certainly uh, speak with you about your company, but then also I think there's certainly a pool of expertise from the panel uh, to, to draw on when it comes to actually setting the actual target levels. Uh, and then when it comes to the reporting, you know, what are those consolidation rules here? Uh, you know, Herman has covered off a few of them that we've, uh, that we've summarized in this presentation and we'll share with you in the documentation. Uh, but, uh, you know, this is where it all kind of comes together for your reporting uh, and, or, or your compensation. Then, uh, which is the last point is to build that into the compensation plans. So just a very rough kind of process uh, uh, in way to use uh, the framework uh, and we have sort of guidance um, at each of the steps from our side. And then, like I said, also from the panel for some broader uh, experience across the group. Mm -hmm.